What began as a call to investigate a suspicious person at Bob Amos Park quickly turned into a rescue operation when the man reportedly fled from police, scaled the cliff in the Pikeville cut-through, and jumped into the Big Sandy River. Police were called around noon on Tuesday to check on the man, but when they arrived, the man ran away, leading to the rescue effort. Uh, he somehow managed to scale the uh, high wall here, dropped into the river, swam the river, got to the other side of the river. Uh, he got uh, trapped on one of the ledges. Uh, we've got uh, pipe fire EMS here. We're going to propel down with a basket and get him off the ledge. We also have our boat in the water right now to make sure if he does fall, if somebody falls, that they've got that part of it. So we're going to bring him up. This has turned into a rescue now. We're going to see what the mental state and the physical state of the individual is now. Getting to the man turned out to be the easy part. Getting him out of the cut through turned out to be significantly more difficult. Once we located him, it appeared the, the male was uh, combative. We sent rescuers down via rappel rope and obtained the victim. Uh, went ahead and secured him on a soaks basket, performed a high angle rescue uh, with the help of the police and uh, other additional units. We hauled him up with the haul system and uh, safely secured him up here on the side of the roadway. Once he was successfully retrieved, the man was placed under arrest. His identity and the charges against him were not known at press time. Miraculously, he suffered no injuries other than to complain of a sore shoulder.